Legend of Total War here with a quick update video to let you know what's going on, specifically in regard to the hot seats, um, spe uh, specifically with the Grand Campaign as well. So obviously the Grand Campaign has really not been a very successful hot seat campaign, I think largely due to my own uh, leniency in regard to turn times, it just hasn't really taken off. I mean, a lot of you guys are definitely enjoying it, it gets a lot of views, but I mean the hot seat itself, the actual play of it. Like it was it was April the last time I did my turn. Really I should be getting one of my own turns done like once every, once a month at the very latest, but I'm doing my turns now like once every four months which is just ridiculous. So I'm going to start cracking down a lot harder on the players for for long delays because it just got to the point where every single just every second player was taking a week or a month to do their turn because they were going on vacation or they had school or whatever like that. So now it's going to be a lot harder, a uh, lot harsher um, on them for, for delaying the hot seat. It's going to be a point now, look, if you can't get your turn down done, either skip it or sub it. That's really it. There's no more excuses now for, for delays. Now, in addition to that, we've got a, we've been tweaking the rules ever since we really started the, the hot seat group. If you remember back in 2014, when we first started the hot seat group, um, the, the Crusades and the Britannia hot seat, the rules were very sort of unbalanced. To an extent, we're not really unbalanced, but um, a lot of rules that you guys didn't really like. So we've been tweaking it you know, to, to accommodate for all the different players. And now we're tweaking it even further to really make sure that it's as fair as possible. I mean, it's, it's kind of hard to make it 100% fair because some factions are just weaker than others. And obviously some players are way stronger than others. Diplomacy can be a bit fucked sometimes things that we need to account for. But anyway, we're tweaking it further and we're going to start a stainless steel 6.4 hot seat. Now I know you might be thinking, you guys can't even get the fucking 17 player grand campaign hot seat going and now you want to start a 23 player um, stainless steel 6.4 hot seat, which will go on for even longer. Yeah, because I feel like with a new set of rules, with a much harder, harsher administration, we will get turns done a lot faster. So the, the stainless steel 6.4 hot seat should theoretically go better than the grand campaign did. Theoretically. I, again, time will tell. Now what I want from you guys is to actually just help me let other YouTubers know that um, this hot seat is available because it is available exclusively to, to YouTubers or speci uh, specifically people with at least somewhat of an established following for Total War videos. So people with like zero subscribers and like one video of a Total War campaign, it doesn't cut it. Um, they need to at least have been making videos for six months, have at least 200 subscribers. Like, I'm not looking for the biggest channels ever. I just want to basically know, are you dedicated to Total War and are you at least reliable with your with your video uploads? That That's the kind of only things I'm looking for. So we're looking for 23 players. We've already got four locked down and I've only really just opened this up like a few minutes ago. So it's going to fill up quite quickly. I just feel like those last few spots like we'll get to 17 easily enough but you know the last six could be difficult and i kind of can't don't have time to just sit there on steam lurking around asking each of my contacts hey do you want to be in this hot seat do you want to be in this hot seat it's actually much more effective i think if you guys let them know that you want them to be a part of this hot seat so anyway i'll leave that with you let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are whether or not we should even do this hot seat although i'm really just not I'm just going to do whatever I want, but that doesn't mean I don't listen, you know, I'm just not always going to take your advice. So let me know and we'll see how we go. And I'll see you next time, fuckers.